How are the lads, everyone? Welcome to a new show. Welcome to a new video, not show, a new video. And I'm reacting to uh, Sven Botman's injury. Uh, it, it's just, um, what is my take? What is the American Magpie's take on this situation? Well, fellas, I mean, uh, ladies and lasses. I mean, my goodness, fellas and lasses. It's a, it's a very intricate situation. And it's a very uh, unfortunate, and I shouldn't say unfortunate. It's very, because... It almost feels like it's a luck thing. And at this point in time, I just believe that Newcastle, there's a negligence, a clear negligence right now in the club. Uh, not, things are not smooth. Things are not as transparent in one, as one would like uh, right now in the football club. That is just the bottom line. Um, what do I think about it? Well, it's another big, big letdown, big blow. Um, bad, bad news. You know, as, as we know that Botman is certainly considered uh, to be by Eddie, one of the best, if not the best, uh, center back that we got in the team right now. Therefore, knowing that our manager's top defender is not going to be part of the uh, of the team right now, is certainly uh, something that that is not well taken. Um, that worries me. Now, a lot of people are going to say, "Well, Lascelles is going to jump in," and I do agree with that. I think Lascelles is going to get the opportunity now. It, as we know that he should, he's going to jump in and he's going to have his say. Uh, he's going to get on the pitch and he's going to play. And, of course, a lot of people want that. A lot of people have been criticizing Botman and want him to, to be sidelined for a few matches. But to, to say the least, uh, an injury like this is certainly not what we Newcastle fans want. Um, it's unfortunate. Uh, well, I keep saying that, but it's, it's, a word of exp it's, a, it's a form of expression. But I, I do know that there are people at fault in this. Uh, and maybe some of these injuries have been due to luck or bad luck or whatever you want to call it. But just the amount of injuries week after week make no sense. And somebody needs to be held accountable for this. There needs to be an audit at the end of the season. There needs to be uh, there needs to be it needs to be ways for us to find out what's going on. Does the medical team need to be sacked? Well, then sack them all if we need to. It's the way we're playing jeopardizing the players because we don't change the way we play. Is that the way it's going to happen? Is that, the, is that one of the reasons? Well, then we need to do something about it as well. And the manager needs to be told either you change your ways or, we, I mean, we got to figure something out because we are letting players get injured left and right. And that, is, that shouldn't be happening. It's unprecedented. Unprecedented. It should not be happening whatsoever in our football club. Uh, so now Newcastle defender Sven Botman will undergo ACL surgery next week. It will be out for six to nine months. That is a very long time. We're not going to see him for a while. And uh, it is very unfortunate, very, very, uh, almost, uh, uh, you know, a, a primitive way uh, that these guys are getting injured. You know, we, I am very much concerned um, because anybody can get injured like this at any point, any given time. And you can tell the Botman just had, this was the last straw. I don't know what's happened. I don't know how he got injured. Uh, but certainly hasn't been playing great. And now all of a sudden, uh, you know, it's going to be, he's going to be gone for months. A club statement read, following further assessment, a scan has confirmed that he sustained an injury to his ACLs during Saturday's match, and he is expected to return in action within six to nine months. Uh, and, you know, this is basically what we got going on with him. Apparently, against uh, in the Saturday match, he got injured against City. Didn't see anything really. Didn't see anything that that would warn of an injury. Um, there were talks before the game that Livermento was hurt, and as we see that uh, he might be hurt. I don't know. We haven't heard anything. So this uh, injury by Botman has caught everybody in Newcastle United by uh, surprise. But really, should it be a surprise? Because week after week we got an injury. We got a, somebody missing. We got somebody in doubt. Never do we go before a match thinking everybody's fully fit. It's a, it's, it's, very, uh, it's a travesty that needs to be investigated, that needs to be dealt with accordingly. And, um, and everybody needs to be punished to the utmost of the law. Um, again, could be medical negligence, could be the way we're playing, that we, we just play one way in, or the highway. And it worries me too, not just for the injuries, obviously, but because in the football, you have to have different methods of winning. If not, then you are very, very predictable. I believe uh, tomorrow afternoon, tomorrow evening, tomorrow night, 10 p.m. UK, 5 p.m. United States Central Time, we will be having a injury show. 
And it's unfortunate that we have to have it, but the insiders are going to have an injury show talking about every injury that we can think of this season and how it has stopped us from maybe achieving what, uh, you know, we could have achieved. Uh, I'm not, uh, I'm not one of the per people that believe that injuries are the only reason as to why we are in this predicament today, but it is certainly a very important reason. Therefore, uh, we need to dive into it. And we will do tomorrow at 10 p.m. on the NUFC Insiders Debate Show later on at night. Again, 5 p.m. United States Central Time, 10 p.m. United Kingdom Time. Uh, as for tonight, we will have the undisputed show between the Mighty Win and I at 11 p.m. UK, 6 p.m. US. Uh, stay tuned. Almost every day shows about Newcastle United at 10 p.m. UK, except for one or two days. One, basically, on Wednesdays. Uh, but as for right now, I appreciate your support. Don't forget to subscribe. Hit the bell for notifications. I, I appreciate your support. My name is Chris, the American Mag. We'll see you on the next one. Bye-bye. Hey, did you know that you can become a member of the show? Help us support the channel. Help us grow for as little as 0.75 British pounds, a dollar a month. It's not much, and you can help us support the channel. And also, you can get great perks. You can get loyalty badges every month showing your support and your loyalty to the channel. You can get customized emojis for you to have fun on the chat. Also, you can get priority reply to your comments, early access to new videos, member shout outs. And of course, you get your name added twice to the monthly raffle, increasing your chances to win monthly prices. Home shirts, away shirts, anything that has to do with Newcastle United. We give away something every month and you can win that as well and if you want to upgrade to the ultimate tier package you can get a lot more perks and exclusive content on top of everything that you get on the first tier you can also get a bigger chance to win in these raffles because you get your name added five times increasing your margin to win these prices as well as exclusive member only videos you get member only live shows and the once upon a time podcast only for you only for ultimate members and in this podcast we talk about the history of newcastle united everything that has to do in the past the entertainers we cover everything throughout history dating back to the beginnings of times so don't miss out it's for a small price every month you get exclusive content and a shot of winning big big prizes at the end of every month what are you waiting for you can join in the first link in the description or click the join button on every video and you should be able to become a member of the show if you want to watch more videos click here or here or subscribe right here and thank you for supporting the channel